What is up guys? I'm Daddy Gamer Fred and welcome back to another Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Let's Go Eevee discussion video. Now, in this video, we're going to be talking about the Nintendo America tweet that basically focused around Cerulean City and gave us some images on the city and of the gym and of Misty that we kind of seen in basically Wildwoods in the trailer. But we do have one in particular image that wasn't in the US trailer, that was on the Japanese website, that was in Japanese that now we have an English one-to-one -one translation of and then also it brings the, up the question about the starter Pokemon and where are we actually going to be able to get them from and how are we going to get them are they going to be in the same places that they were in a yellow version are we going to be able to get them from Professor Oak in the beginning of the game is a lot of those questions flying around right now and let's just jump into this tweet and check it out it says in the Pokemon let's go game Cerulean City is surrounded by waterways where the gym leader Misty waits for trainers to challenge her. Keep an eye out for a mysterious Squirtle roaming the city too. Now, if you play Pokemon Yellow, you will know that Squirtle is actually not in Cerulean City. That Squirtle is actually in Vermilion City. After you defeat Lieutenant Surge, the gym leader there, you go talk to Officer Jenny and she will present you with Squirtle. But in this image, on the Nintendo of America's Twitter, it shows Officer Jenny talking to a Squirtle inside a Cerulean City and Officer Jenny has this mad expression on her face indicating that she's probably mad or upset at the Squirtle on the text bubble that we got it says hey give me back my Pokeball so apparently the Squirtle is basically misbehaving taking the Pokeball from Officer Jenny now one thing we can point out is that Officer Jenny is standing in front of a building we do know that there is a building in this game that this kind of points to being and that would be the one that's in front of the Nugget Bridge, the one that's also getting burglarized. Now, it kind of makes sense that it getting burglarized and actually having Officer Jenny in front of that building because of that reason, or maybe that they switched up the storyline for whatever reason and you cannot get past the city without actually talking to Officer Jenny for whatever reason. Maybe she would give you the Squirtle here. Maybe she won't give you the Squirtle here. Maybe talking to her, she would leave from in front of this building after having that initial issue conversation and then you meet with her again at Vermilion, at Vermilion City but to me I, I'm I'm 100% maybe guessing at this what if we beat Misty and then we are able to pick up Squirtle from Officer Jenny right here in the game that would be kind of not a game changer but that would mean yes we would get Squirtle kind of earlier on in the game we do know Charmander is also above the Nugget Bridge and then Bulbasaur was able to get inside of my home inside of Cerulean City so that would mean you would literally get all startup Pokemon very early on in the game in the same city I kind of like that idea but what do you think do you think that this means that we're gonna get Squirtle here do you think this is just a quick cutscene and then she's gonna run off and then we have to wait until we defeat Lieutenant Surge in Vermilion City and get get Squirtle that way do you think they're gonna be shaking things up maybe Charmander is gonna be at a different spot maybe Bulbasaur is gonna be at a different spot we do know Bulbasaur Bulbasaur was in the Viridian City Forest in the beginning of the game during the E3 demo. But again, that was just a demo. I don't want to say that he's going to be there for sure without actually confirming that he's there when the game is released because it was just a demo build. They probably were just doing that for people playing the game can have a opportunity to catch something like a Bulbasaur out in the wild. But who knows? Maybe they are out in the wild. Maybe there is going to be a way you can catch Gordo outside of this encounter as well as Charmander and Bulbasaur. But let me know your thoughts on it in the comment section below like always guys i'm daddy i'm fred on instagram and twitter and you guys can bring the conversation there i'm the american gamer in switzerland right here on youtube and yes i'm gonna be doing a ton of videos just like this one so if you enjoy please hit that subscribe button also hit the like button it does help me out a ton as far as growing the channel is concerned ring the bell if you want to be notified on the next time i drop a video peace i'm gonna see you guys on the next one